Students at one suburban college are heading back to class tomorrow after frightening threats shut down campus for two days. Some of those threats were found written in bathrooms at Elmhurst College. CBS 2's Stephen Graves found out this has been going on for concern for students. Some students left campus completely uneasy about what's happening here, while others who are staying say they are just plain angry. I heard crying, leaving. So worried and hurt that this Elmhurst College student didn't even want to show her face on camera. Also exhausted from the extensive questioning from police. They're asking us about other people and to pick someone that we think may have done it. Now many students at a loss as to who it could be after the vandalism and threats shut down campus for two days. I was supposed to have a test today, didn't have it. Freshman Jack McKinnis lives in Niebuhr Hall where the investigation began. Like, why did this happen? Like, why here? School officials say last Tuesday the words shoot the school and shoot it up were written on a bathroom stall in a residence hall. The day before, this student says she saw messages with the N word warding off students of color. We already have a stereotype upon us and so now we're actually here trying to get a degree and now you're saying that now we don't belong here on this campus. Police are now investigating even more threats that happened this week, some in the campus library. Students say the issue has only gotten worse. I know the campus was trying to keep it more quiet. Um, in the beginning, like we didn't really know a lot was going on. School officials declined an on camera interview with CBS 2, but in a statement, the president said he hopes the student body will grow from this and that quote, it's been a challenging and difficult week for all of us. Students just want to have peace of mind and go to class as campus police urge anyone with information to come forward. Meanwhile, as campus opens tomorrow, they say there will be heightened security and counselors on hand. Reporting here at Elmhurst College, Stephen Graves, CBS 2 News. Elmhurst College has 3,500 undergrad and grad students enrolled at the school. Police don't believe any of the threats are credible at this time.